The Chantilly Tiffany, also known as the Chantilly, or the Foreign Longhair, is a breed of domestic cat which originated in North America. The Chantilly Tiffany was once thought to be extinct, but it is around and thriving. A characteristic feature of these cats is the unevenness of the color, it is, as it were, lightened in some parts of the body and darkened in others. Chantilly Tiffany are charming representatives of long-haired cats, in which there is something attractive and unusual, the characteristic color for Tiffany is chocolate, but it can be black, purple and blue, changing, becoming lighter, from the ridge to the belly. These cats are very friendly, well-trained and unpretentious in grooming. The history of the origin of the breed. The Chantilly Tiffany breed is a relatively young variety of long-haired cats, so the history of the development of cats can be traced back to the first generation. They owe their birth to Jenny Robinson. In 1967, in a New York pet store, she bought similar heterosexual kittens. They were a beautiful cat and a kitten, with a moderately long coat of chocolate color. After a while, Thomas and Shirley had offspring with similar external data. Jenny Robinson liked the mating result and did not interfere with the further breeding of the pair. So, after a couple of years the chocolate feline parents had several dozen kittens. However, soon the owner of Chantilly got tired of breeding animals. The felinologist Sijin Lund, a breeder of Burmese cats, took her business into her own hands. Sijin Lund bought out the remaining Chantilly Tiffany cats and set to work on breeding. She introduced a new breed to the TICA members as foreign longhair. However, they considered the name ambiguous, after which the chocolate cats were called Tiffany. Lund associated this breed with elegance and luxury. In the late 70s of the last century, the long-haired cat variety was nevertheless recognized as part of authoritative associations, but only as a subspecies of Burmese. Felinolog was disappointed with the decision of the judges of the feline organizations, so she refused to further breed Chantilly Tiffany. So, the fate of the unfortunate cats was in the hands of the Canadian breeder Tracy Orris. She managed to prove that the representatives of the breed have nothing to do with Burmese. Oris did a lot of breeding work to improve the Tiffany, not only the chocolate individuals themselves participated in the breeding process, but also the Angoras, Nibblings, Havanas, and Somali cats. Chantilly Tiffany was recognized as an independent new breed by the experts of the International Association by the mid-90s. Description of the breed. Chantilly has an average body size, proportional physique. Chantilly Tiffany cats have a slender, slightly elongated body. They cannot be called thin, a small but strong body of a cat consists of trained muscles. Tiffany has moderately high, developed limbs with rounded, neat pads. The long tail tapers smoothly towards the tassel, the thick hair covering it forms a chic plume. A distinctive feature of the pet's exterior, inherited from cats of other breeds, is a pronounced wool structure. Chantilly Tiffany has no undercoat, but it has a silky and soft elegant coat. The peculiarity of their cover is that the fur does not fall off and practically does not get dirty, although it sheds noticeably. Longer hair on the neck forms a fur collar, on the legs, pants. The ears and tail are also abundantly pubescent. The fur coat of the ancestors of modern Chantilly Tiffany was painted exclusively in a deep brown color, chocolate. Later, after the implementation of the breeding program, the palette was refreshed with new colors, cinnamon, fawn, lilac and blue. In addition, there are Chantilly tabby, mackerel. Moderately large head of Chantilly Tiffany, wedge-shaped, with a wide muzzle. The proportionally large Chantilly ears, due to the fluffy coat, seem smaller than they really are. They are set wide apart, slightly inclined forward. Wide-open almond-shaped eyes are usually yellow in color, golden, amber shades, and harmoniously contrast with the coat color. Character Traits of Chantilly Cats Chantilly Tiffany's kitten is a very playful and curious creature. Until he turns a year old, the owner needs to keep his ears open. A young animal will be more active and less predictable than an adult cat. Chantilly are usually calm, thoughtful cats. They are smart and quick-witted, thanks to these qualities of Tiffany pets, you can easily teach simple tricks and teach them to walk on a leash. Although exercise is unlikely to delight a fluffy pet. Chantilly cat Tiffany treats all family members equally warmly. But in adulthood, the cat chooses one owner for itself, to which it is most attached. But, despite this, he will not follow the man on the heels. This is an independent animal that makes decisions without outside participation. Therefore, it is impossible to completely control the behavior of Chantilly Tiffany, although on purpose the cat will never misbehave. Representatives of the long-haired breed have a hard time enduring long separation from household members. Therefore, in order to prevent the cat from developing stress, which negatively affects health, you should have another pet. With other cats and dogs, Chantilly Tiffany cohabit under one roof without any problems. In addition, a luxurious cat loves to spend time with children, while communicating with babies, he is careful and sensitive. Care and maintenance. 
Chantilly Tiffany is an energetic and inquisitive breed. In childhood, kittens are distinguished by playfulness and playfulness, with age they become imposing and decorous. This cat is forever devoted to one owner. Only he allows her to do whatever she wants with herself. With the rest he behaves a little regal, although friendly. If the child gets the pussy too much during the game, she will never offend him, she will prefer to leave. She is practically not subject to special training because she is too self-sufficient and uncommon. It is necessary to educate her only in the process of communication. She is smart, communicates with a person on an equal footing, and seems to understand speech. If you find a common language, she will practically predict your thoughts. She does not show arrogance and aggression, she is sociable in the company, but a person should be nearby. Only in his presence does the cat feel comfortable. With other animals, it maintains diplomatic relations, in case of disagreement, leaves. Having got a kitten, buy him a bed, scratching post, tray and filler. The cat quickly and painlessly gets used to all objects. In this sense, there will be no worries. You need at least two bowls for food and water. Also buy hygiene and grooming products. Due to the fact that the coat is devoid of undercoat, there are not very many problems with it. You need an anti-static spray, a comb, a rubber tooth comb, a combi brush, a regenerating hairspray and a furminator, a tool to remove excess hair during shedding. Food. The easiest way to feed this cat is premium ready-made food or holistic, natural, for long-haired breeds. All trace elements and necessary substances are already balanced there. When choosing a natural diet, the following rules should be considered. The basis should be lean meat, about 70% of the total diet. The rest is made up of cereal cereals, pureed vegetables. Sour milk products make up about 5% of the menu. Raw quail eggs and a little boiled sea fish are added to the weekly diet. These are all the basic rules. You need to feed twice, in the morning and in the late afternoon. The amount of food is calculated as follows. 40 grams of food per 1 kilograms of weight. Drinking water must be fresh. All dishes should be washed daily. Plant a special herb on the windowsill. Vitamins and minerals should also be given. And a special agent, gel or paste, to facilitate the removal of wool from the stomach. Pros and cons of the breed. Pros, elegant appearance unlimited devotion to the owner. Intelligence and ingenuity. Absolutely not aggressive, unpretentious, friendly breed. Good health. Good life expectancy. Minuses, loneliness is hard to bear, a companion is needed, either a relative or another animal, or the constant presence of the owners. The rarity of the breed. The high cost of a kitten. Possible diseases the breed is in good health, but there are problems that need care. One of them is discharge from the eyes. They must be removed with a napkin dipped in boiled or distilled water. You can add tea leaves. Obesity can also be a problem if this process is not stopped in time. If the weight of the cat exceeds the norm by 20% or more, if it breathes heavily, shows low mobility, and its spine cannot be felt, put it on a diet. However, consult your veterinarian in addition about taking hormonal medications. Nervous diseases are the protection of a cat from stress, most often from regular loneliness. It happens that the animal even has bold patches from the nervous licking of the fur. It becomes irritable and tired, drinks a lot of water, wags its head or tail for no reason, looks into space for a long time, hunts for air. Here again the help of a specialist is needed. And more attention. Price. The minimum cost of a kitten for 3 to 4 months cannot be less than 500 US dollars and on average about 700 dollars. This is due to the rarity of the breed. In addition, transportation costs will be added, since not all countries have breeders of this breed. Make sure the baby meets the standard, check the documents and vaccinations. When purchasing a kitten, evaluate it externally, make sure that the tummy is soft, not swollen, pus or other discharge should not flow from the nose, ears and eye, it should be clean under the tail. Choose a baby that is well fed, but in moderation, with an even step and no smell from the mouth. The coat should be free from scratching, white teeth, pink gums. Observe the behavior, a funny and curious kitten will grow into an intelligent and devoted friend in the future.